Dang it, have you ever recorded something, or at least thought you were recording it and it didn't record? That just went down. So, that's okay. I can do it again. Um, I am talking about today, about going green, going vegan. Alright? I did it. I didn't get the t-shirt, but maybe I should have. Um, for the record, I am not vegan anymore. I decided from the beginning that I was going to be a vegan because we're all different and we all need to decide and figure out what the best is for for us. You know, prescribing to someone else's program is not going to work for you. You have to figure out on your own what is best. And that is through test and trial. We are our own little bodies and we just got to kind of go for it. So, that being said, um, I would like to, you know, share some little tidbits that I learned from my journey and why I'm not vegan anymore. So, one, loved the energy. It was awesome, but as you can see, pretty good on energy. <laughs> um, so, energy was good. You get so much energy from the plants and vegetables because they're alive foods. So, they're alive going into your system. So, your, your cells and your body are like, yeah and they give you all that energy. Um, easy as pie. I mean, you don't have to think about preparing meats and doing all this stuff. You throw some stuff in a blender, mix it up. All fruits are tasty. So it all just tasted super, super good. And also animal rights. Man, I watched some documentaries and by then I was like this. Like, oh my God, stop it. And I couldn't look at, I couldn't even go down the meat department. And you know Johnny, I mean, he... He lays it down in the steak department, you know what I mean? So I had to figure out how I was going to balance all this. So um, after two and a half months, I just took kind of a, you know, a overall, itchy finger, overall kind of how my body did. And I realized, you know, my hair, I've been trying to get it to grow for forever, but it got like super stringy. Like, super, like, straw-like. It's it's coming back to life a little bit, you know. But I didn't like it, all right? Um, I realized that, you know what? I'm sorry, but all those meats are already packaged. All the animals, they had to go through all this torturing, everything. And now they've gone through all that and you're not going to eat the meat? Come on, man. Come on. So I decided that if you could be thankful over every single meal, thank thank the animal for for being sacrificed or hurt or tortured and having a thankful heart while you eat you know what i mean everyone just like mouths down without having any awareness of of what they're putting in their mouth or what the process was of getting it to you know from animal to mouth you know or from farm to mouth so having a thankful heart when you eat I, I i feel like is the number one thing that i learned while taking that journey and and learning about the vegan lifestyle and i totally commend the people that do it i mean i think later in life heck yeah Vegan, vegan is the way to go when I'm granny, you know, and Johnny too. It'll be good. So, um, so if you're interested in looking into a vegan lifestyle, freely the banana girl, she's awesome and crazy and great lover. And to Asina O'Neill, she's great. They do lots of what they've eaten in a day. So I say, if you're wanting to try it, try it go for it see if it works for you i think it's a great idea for everyone or if you want to cleanse your system out it's a fantastic idea do be careful though if you decide to go off of that lifestyle to do it properly of course you know i um slowly eased into it that i peaked my protein so i could get some gains in the gym and um i ended up super sick so make sure that you ease into it i always 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 every day I'm like a fiber queen you know so I have fiber it's a chia and gold flaxseed mix from vitamin cottage shop I mean I will link it in the description be below so you can get it um, super awesome so I'm gonna be making more videos about what I eat a balanced lifestyle you know I do kinda like to get crazy in the gym and that's just me you can follow me along the way, but I say prescribe to your own journey. Figure out your authenticity, what works best for you. Of course, be inspired by other people. But the best, 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 best thing to do is figure out what's best for you. All right, you have an awesome day, 
and uh, we'll talk to you soon. Later.